Politicians like to call upon the name of Jesus Christ in their speeches during Christmas and many special occasions because theoretically St Kitts and Nevis is still, and this can be argued, a Christian society. Dr Harris made a plausible attempt to explain Christmas and why we should be grateful. Dr Drew, on the other hand, skidded over the thing. But we will let you decide. The birth of Jesus Christ symbolises the embodiment of these virtues, reminding us of the importance of faith, kindness and unity within our community. Christmas, however, is really about God's love for us. In John chapter 3, verse 16, we are reminded that for God so loved the world that he gave us his son. Christmas should be about the nativity story as told in the Bible and the promise of our redemption because Christ our Savior died on the cross as the atonement of our sins. He made this sacrifice so that we may experience joy and peace and live with love for one another and in reverence and obedience to God. The real Christmas story is the story of God becoming a human being in the person of Jesus Christ. Why did God do such a thing? Because he loves us. Why was Christmas necessary? Because we needed a saviour. Why does God love us so much? Because he is love itself. 1 John chapter 4 verse 8. Why do we celebrate Christmas each year? Out of gratitude for what God did for us, we remember his birth by giving each other gifts, worshipping him, and being especially conscious of the poor and less fortunate. With this in mind, Christmas can be a season of great joy. It is a time of God showing his great love for us. It can be a time of healing and renewed strength. Sure, enjoy the season, but remember to rejoice as well. After all, the true meaning of Christmas is the celebration of God's ultimate gift, the birth of Jesus, the Christ child. Please click on the other upcoming video by KN Whoop.